Here I'm Ahmed. Welcome to Miami, you know, you know, army, army. <laughs> we are uh, still in Tunisia, guys, and we are in a moment. But today, it's a finally clear, sunny day. It's windy, but it's sunny. And there's a few clouds, but it's sunny. But it's very, very nice over here. Look at the waves today. It makes it a little more exciting to watch. We need to be like this. When they do the white thing, so Lucas trying to get wet. Okay, now we're going in the Medina. exploring Amamet which with me and Cosy just the two of us yep we drove the car all the way here by ourselves no one else is here huh no one is here so here we are in Amamet and we're going to find this secret bar hidden in the Medusa the, Ma the Medusa the souk <laughs> and apparently you can see the entire ocean from there or the entire town we'll see stay tuned to find out bum 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 <laughs> Luca, you like my so far? Oh, okay. That was your answer. Clear. We're now arrived at the cemetery. Hmm, interesting. Yes. As we are visiting Amamet, it is a very windy day, and as you can see, our hair is going crazy. Except for no, no hair. Super short. Jeez, good <laughs> macho. Que pervento, Amamet, amor. So I think this is a little amp amphitheater. It's very small and it's very colorful too, covered with all the graffiti art. <laughs> what are we doing now, Ma? We're going in a cemetery. Oh, uh, there is a tomb of a um, dead guy, an Italian politician. That basically was He's had to hide in Tunisia because of many political issues political and so they they welcomed them here he could never go back to Italy oh <gasps> wow yes they offered to do his uh, ceremony for when he died in Italy but at that point the family refused they didn't he wasn't welcome anymore when he was alive what he why would he go back well, that's not a very nice I know well he did a few things that weren't very right to do wait i'm trying to find his tomb now yeah let's Looks see like it's down how are you gonna find this tomb if you so wait his tomb is on gps apparently it's like an historical landmark oh hmm it'll be like finding a dude hey look at along the side of the cemetery you have a wonderful puffy flower yellow flower tree that's what i'm calling it now a yellow puffy flower tree along with this other tall tree that is around here. I have no idea why I'm talking about trees, but it's just fun to talk about. Hi, move out of the way! And Luca has his big car mode. Bum, bum, bum. Right. So we think we found it because, well, there's an Italian flag. So it would probably make sense. It's here. This part of the cemetery, it seems a lot older than the other part. Aha, there it is. This is the tomb of... Bettino Cracks? And he just died of oh, Well, no, don't say it like that. He died. No, he died. Well, he did die. Yeah, well, he did. <laughs> this is a very big cemetery all around there. <laughs> we quickly walked around the whole fort from outside. Now we have to try to get inside. There's a little too many rocks. It's fine. It's fine? You just go slow. Yeah, that's not like you to go slow. <laughs> hey, don't video me. <laughs> Stop videoing me. We are entering again because what we entered and then we got out of the Medina. We had to try all the entrances. Let's put it that way.
I think we've never seen as many forts as we have in Tunisia. We've been to every fort. Here we are again. This is the fort in Amamet. We got another one. So we are going to climb to the top because it looks like there's not much to see other than the walls. But the position is so cool because it's right on the sea. Here shows you a little museum. Traditional costumes. This fort has something different. Look at that. He's gonna shoot you. I'll catch you, don't worry if you jump. I'll, I'll jump, if you jump, I'll catch you. Okay, sit right there. Come on this bread. The beautiful thing, guys, here, see, we are uh, right at the bathroom. <laughs> no, the beautiful thing is, like, there is nobody. We are the only, only tourists. Not a good thing for the economy and for the country. Uh, I'm really sad for that because every place is like this. But it's a good thing for us because we get the chance to visit everything by ourselves. And it's a little bit easier with kids. Yeah. Because you don't have to worry about other people. <laughs> I have more hair. These are the joy of staging. <laughs> right, yeah. mommy? Yes, takes yeah, forever. <sighs> Guys. Patience. Be patient. Such a great virtue. Wherever you go. Be patient. Wherever you go. We are. We just stand here and wait for them to finish climbing whatever they're climbing. And the yeah. grandparents are just there waiting. waiting. Go, 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 go. Ah! Huh? Oh! <laughs> 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 
Bye. Bye. Pooba just tried to come out.